Hey everyone, so today I'm going to show you how to make video. Hey everyone, so today I'm going to show you how to make video carousels in Framer that deals with everything from auto playing on the next video, stopping other videos, muting. You can custom design it. Uh, it's got a really great mobile experience. So this is just um, an example of a of a design I've made. If you play it, I never do risky stuff like that. I'll mute that. Um, every video only plays one video at a time, stops the other sound and things like that. And then if I jump across to um, phone as well, reload, you've got a really nice video carousel on mobile too. And you can also create versions where it's full screen and swiping board, like, um, like you're swiping through Instagram reels and you can add See, the most of it. Um, and things. So to do this, we're going to use a tool called Clipara where you can create these embeds and embed them straight into your Framer site. So just create an account. Then in the Clipara dashboard, you're just going to start by creating a campaign. And we're going to use an on-site campaign for adding it to our website. And the experience that we're going to create in this example is the inline where the video is playing the page. Then the other option you have is to do a full screen video where it opens to full screen like this and is then swipeable like a bunch of Instagram reels. So let's go for the inline option. You can then upload your video content. So you can bulk upload a content from your computer. You can add content from Instagram or TikTok. I've already added in a bunch of videos in here. So let's grab the content that I had used um, in the example. And you can drag and reorder this content. You can also set it to randomize. You can also, if you want to add images mixed in with the carousels, uh, well, let's create that campaign. And then you have a bunch of different templates that you can use um, with, you can also add the captions onto each video. So there's a few different styles here. I'm gonna use this one. You can also just start from scratch on your design. So I'm gonna use this template here. For now, I'm going to make a few little changes to make this a bit like the example I showed you. So I'm going to change the play button to black. I'm going to move the play button into the center. Uh, let's make the play button a bit bigger as well. And then on the layout, add a bit of spacing. We can round off the corners of the thumbnails so you can essentially customize this um, to match your site design, you can change the navigation arrows, uh, all this kind of thing. You can also customize the thumbnail. So just click the thumbnail icon on each video and you can set the thumbnail um, for the preview. And yeah, there's a bunch of other things in here. You can also add titles to each video. So if you want to just click edit subtitles and you can create um, titles and subtitles that give context to the videos. This, uh, and then you, again, you can, you can design these, you can change the sizes of them. Um, bunch of other things you can do there. I'll just turn those off for now. So once we've created our carousel, you're then just going to embed it in Framer. So going to hit save and you get this install install snippet here. And we're just gonna copy this and go and take that back into Framer. So to add your video embed into your frame site is really simple. Um, we are just going to find, let's click add a section into the page and then go to utilities and we're going to add an embed and then just drag this embed into where you want it to sit on the page. We're going to set the um, width as 100% and then fit content as the height. And then it's just a question of pasting in the code snippet that we have. So paste in HTML and there you have your video carousel and you've got it on mobile too. So let's just drag mobile down to wherever you want it to be in the page. Um, and that's pretty much it. And then if you want to customize the designs, update videos, you just do that um, within Kipara. 
if we jump into preview, you can see the mobile carousel. And when you use this, it's going to play one video at a time. It's going to have global mute controls across all of the videos. Um, and if we jump across to mobile, to desktop, sorry, um, you just need to reload to load the desktop carousel. And there you have your videos. Uh, and the other option you can do, which is within Kipara, is if you choose full screen as an option, then when you click and play the videos, they are going to go into a full screen experience, uh, more similar to Instagram. So you can swipe with your thumb up and down between videos. You can add in different buttons um, to the videos. So I will do a different video on how you do that.